Good morning, I am John. Today is Wednesday, April 12th, 2023. Thanks for joining me for my daily vlog, uh, which is really just a daily documentation of my experiment to try to make content creation a sustainable hobby. <laughs> uh, after I got laid off from my longtime job a few months back. Uh, all right, let's start as we do each day talking about yesterday and how we got to where we are. Uh, so yesterday was podcast editing day and uh, it wasn't largely attended, but it was largely productive. Uh, I think I beat the noon deadline. You start at 10 and I was done before noon actually. Many days it rolls over into 12.30, 12.45. Uh, but it was very productive uh, and got most of that done. This morning I'll finish up, I'll talk about it in a second, getting you know, ready to get that published for tomorrow. Um, and then in the afternoon, uh, I did several little tasks to prep me for the rest of the week. I feel like my week is really rushing in on me. Like it's Wednesday already and I haven't got the things done that I want to get done. Um, but I, uh, uh, I talked about, <clears throat> we, <clears throat> was it um, I mean, late last week <clears throat> or early this week, we talked about that uh, some of the short form videos that are tips for old arcade games are doing incredibly well. And right now they're like the top five performers uh, of the last 48 hours. Uh, are all these short videos that are arcade shorts. Uh, so since you know YouTube has a hold of something, I'm trying to do some more of that. So I spent some time yesterday, a couple of hours building and publishing another one of those, which again is doing quite well. It's in the, that top five I was talking about. Uh, now doing shorts is like, this is ex experimental. You know, we, I talked with a team the other day about maybe since these are doing so well, doing fewer of the podcast shorts and more of these arcade shorts. <clears throat> the, uh, the thing is these arcade shorts take a little more time, uh, but it, it, really it's, I'm more fearful I'm running run out of them before YouTube gets tired of me. You know, so there are only so many little tips and trips and tricks out there. Yesterday I did one that didn't seem like a trick to me, but it, 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 you know, realistically, lots of people don't know it. Uh, so even though it seemed obvious to me, I did one. It was about Pac-Man, another one of those. You probably saw it around the socials if you were paying attention yesterday. Um, so uh, speaking of, uh, I said yesterday I would share with you that uh, these, these arcade short videos, they don't generate a lot of revenue, but they generate a lot of traffic and some subscribers. So, you know, sp spending time on this is kind of an experiment, just like everything is an experiment to see how it does. Uh, but uh, I'll show you this Donkey Kong and I think it's like up over 80 or 90,000 views now. Uh, but the biggest short that we've ever had on, uh, on YouTube, certainly. Um, and it just keeps driving engagement and subscribers and comments periodically. You know, fewer comments on the shorts, of course, but way more of the likes and subscribes. So uh, that's something, I guess, that's interesting. Um, uh, we haven't crossed another barrier, but we're halfway there. We're a little over the sub count, 14,000, I'm sorry, 22,000, 14,000, where'd I get that? 22,450 some odd, I think. So probably, eh, we've been averaging about 40 a day. So I would say by Friday, I would expect us to hit that uh, 22.5. Well, I'm stuck on 14, 22.5. Probably by Friday is my guess, unless something accelerates. Uh, today though, so uh, let's talk a little bit about what I have today and I'll tell you about a disruption that I have in my week that I kind of alluded to at the beginning of the week. Uh, I have really like two or three long form videos that I've been prepping for. I started one yesterday and did some research on it, which sometimes at the beginning of a video is do research and see what, and it hit a dead end. So I'm like, well, that didn't really go anywhere. So that was time spent, but not spent in something that you'll see the, the end result for. And sometimes that's, that's overhead, the cost of, you know, cost of doing business. Uh, so, but I do have several, three more possible long form videos that I just kind of have to evaluate which one I think I can accomplish and finish, uh, to get out by the end of this week. Um, and, uh, and I, I say, hopefully get out by the end of the week because, uh, I have this big, big disruption in my week. It's a good disruption. I'm excited about it, but it will take some time. Uh, hopefully I'll spend most of this time over the weekend, but effectively in the, uh, in this is the studio. In my office where I edit, uh, I edit on uh, a large TV and kind of like a like a theater man cave kind of area where I do my work. And that TV has been slowly dying over the last year or so. As it gets a little bit worse and a little bit worse, uh, it's okay to casually watch, but as a monitor, it has problems. So uh, my mom and I are doing a kind of a shuffling of things where she helped me acquire a new television to replace it. And we're gonna give her that television because it's good for just watching TV on, but not so much for a monitor. Uh, and also, uh, and I shuttle those things back and forth. She lives about two and a half hours away. 
Um, so we're gonna try to load all of that onto the weekend, but certainly as deliveries come and I'm you know cleaning up and organizing, and as you might imagine, in a, I have a television that's been sitting there for, oh, eight or nine years, just not being moved and not being touched and has a million wires running behind it and integrated everything and cables. And I'm gonna have to dismantle that office, which is gonna take a lot of work probably over the weekend. So um, yeah, I have that. It's kind of like, okay, the delivery's coming, but I can't deal with it now, but I gotta do something and start working. And so I have that, like that extra layer of stuff I need to get done. Um, that's gonna distract me somewhat, I guess. So I have to, uh, I'm trying to, to, I try to front load stuff, but the week, as you remember, Monday didn't go as I'd hoped, and then Tuesday was just full because I already had podcasting stuff. So we'll see hopefully today, Thursday, and Friday, uh, see how much more productive I can get. Hopefully, I'll just get motivated and get that stuff done despite the distractions. Um, let's see. And then the, the, tonight, we have a recording of the 1980s Now podcast, which will kind of cap off my evening. Uh, and then we're going to roll in toward the end of the week tomorrow. So uh, I'm really encouraged by... I think I'm encouraged by how these shorts are doing. Uh, because they're doing so well, look, I've always been told, if YouTube is doing something you like, do more of that. So, which is why I focused more on these shorts over the last couple of days, just because that's what's doing so well. And uh, yeah, so we'll, I'll continue to think along those lines. Maybe I can try to get one of those shorts out again today. That would be good. Uh, we'll see how today shakes out. If it sounds like I don't have a solid plan, it's because I don't. I feel like I have a lot of things I want to do again, and I'm not sure which one is going to catch my attention, which is going to be the, the shiny thing that I turn toward. But the good, I, I know something will get done today. I'm just not sure which thing. <laughs> okay. Hey, thanks for stopping in for today's chaotic vlog. I felt almost, uh, if you're here every day, I love you for that. Thanks so much. And, uh, Hey, have a good Wednesday. Take good care of yourself and I'll talk to you tomorrow. <laughs>